On Thursday, 28th of July, Senator Ajimabi also declared open the retreat organized for the National Working Committee of Action Congress of Nigeria. In his goodwill address to the National Working Committee of Action Congress of Nigeria, who are in Ibadan for retreat, the state governor, Senator Abiola Ajimabi, explained that ACN as a political party is noted for landmark performance in governance, and Oyo State will not be an exception. He said he has embarked on massive beautification of major cities in the state and rehabilitation of road network, adding that other areas of commitment shall also be vigorously pursued. He commended the leadership of ACN for infusing intellectuality to party administration. We inherited a government whose institutions have been bastardized and destroyed. It is like starting a state afresh. As product of ACN, a party with a tradition and heritage of performance, we are committed to building on this heritage to, to deliver on our promises. We have also embarked on a massive rehabilitation of the roads in the state because of the road network and the drainage system in most of our urban areas have been destroyed by the absence of routine and periodic maintenance. The heavy rainfalls recorded in the last few weeks have led to the loss of lives and properties. Our government is handling environmental sanitation and rehabilitation of our road network as an emergency so that we can restore hope to our people. In his opening address titled A Vision of True Federalism, the National Chairman of Action Congress of Nigeria, Chief Bisi Akande, traced the nation's problem to 1914 when Nigeria was amalgamated by the British colonialists. He said the 1989 inauguration of National Revenue Mobilization, Allocation and Fiscal Commission by the military government had no capacity to prevent the injustices and financial inequities that military federalism perpetrated on the people of Nigeria. He, however, described true federalism as an arrangement of functions and allocation of revenue between the federal, the state, and local government in which all the levels of government will be free within the constitution to perform its function in its own ways at its own pace. He also described as fraudulent the process of using the federal powers to subordinate the developmental opportunities of the federating units. He, however, charged the National Working Committee of ACN to use the opportunity of the retreat to embark on collective search to help Nigeria find solution to its intractable problems. Federalism is a most complicated system of governance that are generally avoided and unwanted by most policy all over the world. No country wants to adopt federalism as a system of government unless it becomes difficult and impossible to govern. Earlier in his welcome address, the National Secretary of the Action Congress of Nigeria, Senator Lawan Shaibu, said the retreat was organized based on the need to consolidate on the sources recorded by ACN in the last election. He noted that the retreat will also explore ways of making ACN stronger through its organ in anticipation of future elections. Later in the evening of the same day, the National Working Committee members were hosted to a dinner party and Senator Abiola Ajimabi, despite his tight schedule, also attended the dinner. The event provided an opportunity for the National Chairman of ACN, Chief B.C. Akande, to cancel the State Governor, Senator Abiola Ajimabi, on the challenges of governance. Uh, I've been a governor myself, and at the beginning, the story was very, very bad. The press, the labor, the people, the women, everybody, the teachers, you know, they said all oh, kinds, they were even cursing me. But when I left office, they all turned around to be praying for me. That's the kind of thing we want our leaders to be. It's like giving a cloth to a tailor. We need to step on tools. It's not important to do a second time. It's not important. It's not how long. It is how well. And I'm, I'm saying it to you openly today. We are the party that nominated you to be the governor for your state. And we thank the people of your state for accepting you and for voting for you and making you the governor of your state. In this response, Senator Abiola Ajinobi promised to deliver the dividend of democracy to the people of your state 
even if he has to step on toes. He, however, called on the people of the state to support the present administration to achieve a greater Sussex. I've always told people, it is not how long you are there, it's how well. And if you are too careful about stepping on toes, you will not accomplish anything. I will not stop on anybody's toes. I will step on their legs from the top to the bottom unless they go along with us.